For the first time in more than 600 days, Friars fans are back together at the dunk. It's been a year and eight months since Providence College basketball tipped off at their traditional home court. Loyal fans wouldn't miss it for the world, and local businesses are welcoming back with open arms. 12 News reporter Sheena Loshudo is live in Providence with all the excitement. Sheena? Well, for the businesses right by the dunk, they've really been serving the PC community for years now. So tonight felt like a homecoming. Great, Great night, night to be back. For Friar basketball fans, it's been a long year and a half. Friars are back, baby! Let's go! The team hasn't played a game here at the Dunkin' Donuts Center since March 7th, 2020. As we all know, COVID-19 concerns took over shortly after that. It's going to be the first game of the year at the Dunk. I'm pretty excited. With fans finally back inside, businesses in the area are looking forward to a successful season. Murphy's on Fountain Street is just a minute walk from the arena. We've been part of this PC basketball family for a better word for years, yes. So a lot of familiar places. Ruth Ferrazano is the owner of the pub, it's become a hot spot for Friar fans. She'll never forget when downtown Providence felt more like a medical ward to her, with the dunk being a mass vaccination site and the convention center a field hospital. So seeing her loyal customers in their PC gear just feels right. On a weekday night, you're going to have them before the game. Before the game, it's always the busiest because they want to get in, they want to have a bite to eat, and they've been doing that for years. Have a beer or two or drink or two, whatever they choose. Tuesday's matchup is the first of many games, a hopeful sign that the season will bring victories in more ways than one. It's a word we use an awful lot lately, it's normal, but this has been feeling for a while that people are more confident to get out. Yeah, it was really an exciting night here in Providence, and we spoke to a lot of those fans before the game, but the owner of Murphy says a lot of the times people come back after the game as well, and of course that brings in even more business. We're live in Providence tonight. I'm Sheena Lushudo, 12 News.